Okay, here we are. This is what it looks like uh, before our pass. And uh, we're on the gas machine side discharge. I'm just going to mow down here a little bit, let you kind of hear the motor, hear the pull down, and, uh, and decide for yourself. pass uh, two passes with the gas we are going to uh, we're going to go get on the diesel make the same identical passes and uh, kind of give it a test and uh, listen for it as well so here we are and uh, we're going to make the same identical pass with the diesel as we did the gas just to kind of give you an idea of both the uh, sound of the motor while it pulls down, uh, the dust factor, and the build up on the side.
So with that being said, you could hear by the diesel that uh, I never really strained it or pulled it down. Uh, the dust factor was not even comparable. It was like you were mowing in a completely different field in a whole completely different day. No comparison as far as the dust factor. Uh, we have just enough wind to make the uh, side discharge be pretty miserable uh, when that wind works against you. Uh, again, we've we've wore out one of these uh, diesels with the rear discharge, so we have a lot, a lot of experience with that. And uh, again, uh, the ability to trim out of both sides and the dust factor and the trash going under the machine. Um, and second of all, uh, we mow a lot of industrial sites, and so the safety factor of not throwing things out the side uh, is a big, big plus to us. Anyway. That's both of them side by side. Uh, hope you enjoyed, and uh, we enjoyed uh, putting it together. Thank you. Okay, so today we're doing a uh, short clip here. We've got two grasshopper mowers. They're both brand new, uh, thanks to our uh, dealer here and our grasshopper rep. Uh, they've given us both of these to do a, uh, a demo side by side, and so we have here a <clears throat> new 900 big block uh, gas motor, uh, the Briggs and Stratton Vanguard, and both of these have 72 inch. And uh, this one on the gas just happens to be a side discharge, and the one over here on the 900 diesel is a rear discharge. Now, uh, okay. So we're, we've got uh, this rear discharge. We, uh, to be perfectly honest, we're not even considering the side discharge because of the kind of mowing we do. And uh, I'm gonna get back on both of these mowers here in just a minute and uh, show you what I'm talking about, why our reason is uh, that we don't use the side discharge. One of them is just the ability to trim uh, on both sides but then the second is we uh, the only thing we've got this time of the year to find to do this test is just some old dead dry grass we don't have any tall green weeds yet so with that being said it's kind of its own uh, limitation and its own experiment but with that being said I'm going to walk you down here and kind of give you an idea of what what just happened so we took both of these mowers and this side over here is the diesel rear discharge and that is uh, one, one pass. And uh, the diesel made one pass right here. And uh, this right here, this lane is the gas with the side discharge with one pass. And this lane is the gas side discharge two passes so kind of give you an idea of the cut here um, in a minute I'm going to take both machines and this is what we're mowing here which is um, it's it's big and it's tall and it's dry um, and we're just trying to use this uh, for for the experiment but anyway I'm going to get on both machines and I'm going to make a fresh cut through there so that you can see and hear the uh, the motors pull down and the stress that we put them under we have both mowers set up exactly the same in that they're both set at four inches which under normal conditions we mow as a general rule at three inches most of the stuff we mow and then when we get into a situation like this where we, we need to raise it, we'll go up from there or we can go down. But just most things that we mow, normally we set that on three inches. Now, I'm, I'm a big fan of the diesel. Uh, I've, had, uh, I've had one of each of these machines except the, my diesel's way older than this one and my gas is way older than this one. So these are both brand new machines. But with that being said, one of the things that we're watching for and looking for is this radiator setup and uh, so this is what we've got in the radiator and in what we mowed here on the diesel side is 
literally about less than 15 minutes and so with that being said this is what we showed up on the radiator so uh, in our line of work you know we may start this machine and uh, drive it all day sometimes we may you know do something just for one hour or three hours or four hours but a lot of our situations the driver will get on it at the beginning of the day and set it off at the end day after day okay this is going to kind of end the um, uh, end of both of the short clips here and uh, just wanted to give you these two machines side by side uh, doing the same exact thing same application kind of give you an idea of the power and uh, also the rear discharge versus the side discharge Anyway, appreciate it. Thanks for watching.